I know I look awesome in my blanket. <laughs> my messed up hair. Um, there. Um, so yeah, I don't know what's going on. I really confused. And I know I say that a lot. I know I say that a lot. Um, I'm right now at the point of, like, I feel like deleting my Facebook. All my Facebooks. Deleting the fan pages. I feel like deleting my YouTubes. I feel like deleting my Twitter. I feel like deleting all my online personalities. Um, kind of. And then at the other point, I, I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I have a lot of thinking to do this weekend. Um, A lot of crap and um, I don't know it's like like he has perfect timing or something he just knows when everything in my life is crap <laughs> when I'm the most vulnerable and um I really don't know. I mean, like, things don't make sense in my head, but they do, and I'm being vague, I know. And here's the thing, like, people can be mad if you want. And I'm borderline, I'm bipolar, I make stupid mistakes a lot. I don't know what my decision is yet. I'm still thinking. Like, I know this doesn't make any sense to anyone, probably, but me. And maybe somebody who's been there before. But it's like the pain of familiarity is so much easier to handle than the pain of the unknown. Like, it sucks. Having hopes. Having good expectations. And then having them crushed. Rather than just knowing that things are gonna suck. You know. It hurts so much more. so tempted, like, the way everything's going, and I thought I had so much here, but it's like, I don't feel like it anymore, I'm like, my girl best friend, like, still, you know, too wrapped up with her boyfriend to even know that I'm, like, alive. And freaking Juggalo could care less. And then I know she didn't mean ill, but my roommate goes and tells the Juggalo. That I hung out with my best, or that I'm hanging out with my ex best friend, and he blows up at me and gets mad and decides that he does nothing to do with me ever again. He 
because somehow I'm betraying him. And I'm a whore. I'm this and I'm that. It's like, really? <sighs> and I'm like, maybe Vegas wouldn't be such a bad thing. Like, if I didn't delete my online personas, there's photographers in Vegas. There's other girls in Vegas. <laughs> there's bashes in Vegas. It could be good for my career. I don't know. I really don't know. But at least I'll feel needed and wanted. Even if it is it's just for somebody who wants me to take care of them. They know he'll never leave me. Sounds pathetic, I know.